Now, the former Conservative Health Minister, Ken Clark, is giving evidence to the ineffective blood inquiry today. Lord Clark was a Conservative Health Minister in the early 1980s, when up to 30,000 people with haemophilia and other bleeding disorders were given contaminated blood products. Apologies for that. We are having, as you can see, some, some technical difficulties here. We'll plot on, though. Uh, and victims were given a clotting agent, which had been imported from the US where it was made from plasma donated by prisoners and other groups at risk from blood-borne viruses. Well, around 3,000 people died after being given the blood products containing HIV and hepatitis in the 1970s and 1980s. Speaking at the inquiry, Lord Clark said that the blood products did not fall under his remit. I was, I was never the minister directly responsible for blood products. I was never asked to take a decision on blood products. I never intervened to take a decision on blood products. Blood products, I was never directly responsible. Uh, unless someone pointed out to me uh, that something was going on so far as the blood transfusion service or blood products, I had nothing to do with it. And that was, that was true for most of my time in the Department of Health.